Some drivers might not realize it, but what they're passing has been dubbed Gateway, a new 50-ton sculpture towering over the Broadway viaduct. The vision for the project comes from the mind of Ed Carpenter, a Portland-based artist who's been creating public art for almost 40 years. The piece is part of an Iowa West Foundation public art project. One of the uh, sites that had been identified many years ago, well, a few years ago, by the public art master plan for the city of Council Bluffs was this bridge. And uh, the master planners had understood that there was some potential to have this bridge be special. And so I got involved because of that. Gateway is made up of a collection of beams reaching towards the sky and intersecting with each other. And partly it's a question of, well, how can you reach across and do something that is not the typical just archway? So, and it has to be structurally sound. It's 100 feet across, and you end up with something that's very high because you have to clear all the traffic. And so I was just trying for something that's radiant and delicate against the sky, and so that it's... It feels like part of the sky. Carpenter is hoping the unique design makes the community proud. And if it's sited properly, and if it's the right scale for its site, then I think it can be effective. And I think it can be something that 50 years from now, people will be careful to support and uh, rise up if somebody tries to tear it out, you know, if it's really successful. And that, then that's my objective, is to make something that people will love 50 years from now. Although he designed the piece, Carpenter wants the community to recognize teamwork played an enormous role in the project. I did this as part of a team, and that there are a lot of people from the Iowa West Foundation, its staff members, its board members, many of their consultants, as well as people from the City of Council Bluffs, people from uh, the Iowa Department of Transportation, and consultants in the engineering firms and landscape architecture firms that have all been working on this together. 